to Angels Light to Row. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your monthly general message for July 2021. Now, this is not a love message. However, don't click away. If love comes up, yeah, we're going to just we're definitely going to discuss it. All right, angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy for Gemini. Yes, yes, yes. Angels and guides, positive energy for Gemini. Mm -hmm. You see, you, you see that. You see that? Angels, high vibrations. I don't know why there's no sun up in the sky. I'm just kidding. I don't know why that song just came. Yes, yes, yes. Angels, we're looking for high vibrations. And also, yes, this is my, mm -hmm, my mama's deck for lovely, lovely Gemini. Hmm, okay, all right, so let's go ahead and look into, yes, angels, high vibrations, yes, 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 for lovely, lovely Gemini, hmm. for the month of for the month of July. All right, angels, we're looking for some joy. Yes, we are for Gemini the Twins, the birthday month for Gemini. Hmm, angels, what's going on? Wow, wow, I'm gonna say wow. What is going on? Now, like I said, if love, wow, if love pops up, we are looking into this yes, yes, and, and yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, what we're going to do, we forgot to add one more to the major, the major theme for the month for Gemini. Thank you. All right, now, we're going to add one Buddha bonus for the month, and that is emptiness. Emptiness. Why are you, I feel like you're, I feel like you're, I'm just feeling like I'm going to go on the high side of that. And I'm going to say somebody's uh, going through some minimalistic um, practices. Maybe you're getting rid of old stuff. Yeah, you're emptying out uh, emotional stuff as well. Okay. All right. Now, let's take a peek, Gemini, into your major theme. With the Ace of Swords, the Eight of Diamonds, Rewards, Eight of Hearts, and the Two of Clubs. Well, look at you, Gemini. All right. New beginnings. These new beginnings are fertile. They are growing. Yes. With the Eight of Diamonds, I feel like you, are you guys starting a brand new financial endeavor? Because it's powerful and you will see the rewards from it. Eight of hearts, you have the emotional ability with the two of clubs to get what you want from people. You can wrap them around your little finger. Okay. All right. Now, don't abuse that. That's all I'm going to say, Jim, but I don't abuse that. Now, when we look at the end, at the recent past, you had the Hermit with the Ten of Spades and the Stealth card. Ten, ooh, ten of Spades again and the Ace of Hearts. So in the recent past with the Hermit card, I see you had spent a lot of time alone contemplating, thinking, thinking, thinking. I feel like it has to do with work. Yes, successful work. I feel like with the Ace of, with the, ace, with the Stealth card, I feel like all you guys were doing were working in the recent past alone. Kind of lonely. Just work, work, work. I'm going to leave that in the past, okay? All right, now, let's look in the middle of the month. We have the two of cups reversed, right? With the three of clubs, illusions, three of spades, and the six of hearts. So in the middle of the month, I see that your love relationships, remember I said love, if it showed up, we were going to talk about it. So with the two of hearts, now this two of heart can be a love relationship, romantic relationship. It could be with a family member, a child, someone that you have a very deep heart connection with. Yes, it is there, but it's not where you would like it to be. You are worried about it. It's just an illusion. This is driving you crazy. Nothing's wrong here. Okay, I'm just gonna say there's nothing wrong here. It's all up here in your imagination. Or maybe, maybe somebody thinks something's wrong on their side. Depending on where you're sitting in this message, maybe someone in your world thinks that there's something wrong and there really isn't. Everything is just a okay. So if it's someone in your world thinking that there's something wrong, make sure you let them know everything is okay. It's 
and an illusion. All right, now that's in the middle of the month. Now let's take a peek, shall we, at the end of the month. We have the, the Eight of Wands with the Eight of Clubs friends, yes, 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 seven of spades and the four of hearts. So by the end of the month, I see with the eight of, I feel like there's an in, you're inundated with a lot of friends, with a lot of conversations, your, your text messages, your phone, you know, in the past you felt alone. Okay. By the end of the month, you're feeling like, okay, enough already. This could be coming from your love interest. It could be coming from friends or family. With the eight of clubs, it's not stopping no it's not letting up with this i feel like this has to do with friends family your communication is going to be on fire <laughs> with the seven of spades you, you it might start to bother you it might start to bother you but don't worry too much about it with the four of hearts i feel like um I feel like it's all going to work out well, and there's a part of you that's kind of happy to hear from friends and family, but it does feel like, sometimes it feels like it's way too much. It's so much communication, and I feel like for some of you, for some of you, there looks like there could be, this, if this is love, right, for some uh, singles, let's go with singles, I feel like there is um, love coming, a lot of communication about love, they are not letting up, yes, some of them are friends from the past okay or maybe you put them in the friend zone from the past and they're coming back they're coming back with the seven of spades i feel like there's a part of you that really doesn't want them to come back with the four of hearts you kind of are you kind of are i feel like whoever this is if this is a friend from the past or romance from the past you're kind of happy and and where you are you're really happy you really don't need to you know with social media you know people find people from the past and they start up stuff that you know from the past it's like you know leave it alone if it was in the past there's a reason why it's in the past if it was an old friend if it was an old acquaintance if it was an old romance leave it leave it you know you know you're fine <laughs> you're fine everything is great why add drama why add yeah just just leave them in the past okay all right now when we look at your bonus here with the wheel of fortune the knight of cups the six of spades celebration nine of diamonds and the queen of spades so your bonus is telling me the world card everything is going your way yes it is with the knight of cups emotionally you are moving in the right direction and this direction that you are moving into it's gonna be long term okay so if you feel good you know that saying if you see me happy leave me alone okay so if they see you happy leave Gemini alone okay it's time for Gemini to celebrate it's time for Gemini like you have everything that you need in the world whatever you want to go out and get it is there for you with the Queen of Spades there is a part of you that feels like you really don't want to spend that much money on things, but you know, that's an internal struggle. Okay. You, you know, you like nice things. So yeah, it don't, you know, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Everything is going your way in your bonus. Everything is going your way. It's going to continue to go your way. You have emotional power here. If this has to do with a relationship, you have emotional power your relationships are going your way it is time to celebrate you need to let go with the nine of diamonds let go of anything that does not serve that joy that does not serve that happiness so i'm picking up that this has something to do with someone trying to come back from the past <sighs> right and i feel like somebody's trying to mess with your joy like i said if you see gemini like just because somebody you know sometimes people see you and they think 
Gemini, you're too darn happy. Okay, let me go in there and put in, put in some confusion, right? Right, so if you see Gemini happy, let them be. If they're happy in their relationship, if they're happy in their home life, if they're happy at their job, let them be. So Gemini, if someone comes in to your world from the past, let them be, <laughs> let them be in the past, okay? Because you are happy and you are content right where you are, all right? And everything, like I said, you might think, here's the thing, you might think in the middle of the month that you're not happy, that things aren't great, but it's just an illusion, things are really great. That's probably what's making you think, maybe I will talk to that person from the past, don't do it. <laughs> don't, don't do it. That's just an illusion. Everything is great, okay? So, yes, leave Gemini alone. I'm going to leave it there. I send you joy. Namaste. And much, much love sent your way.